right hello guys welcome to my channel on today's video i'm going to teach you how to boost choose tax assets my previous video i already shared with us how to add a foreign admin to your page being sincere with us this method of posting with task access is actually uh, a method that facebook is against currently all right but uh, i'm going to share with you a way that you will be posting with tax access even in an ineligible country now before i go into the video i i want to highlight that uh, before you post with task access there are little things that you need to do all right guys so this is what you are going to do before you start posting on this page your task assists okay pay a very good attention to this because this will actually end a problem of i cannot post on my page because i am in an ineligible country now the first thing you are going to do is get a brand new phone i'm not talking about uh, a fairly used phone a brand new phone okay once you get a brand new phone, the second thing you're going to do is to off the location on the phone, all the locations on the phone, off it. Whether it's an Android phone or an iOS phone, off all the locations. Search for locations on the phone. You can search on YouTube to get how to off location on any kind of device. So make sure all the device, uh, device locations are turned off. Now, the third thing you are going to do that is very important is to delete all many apps that you can. Any app on the phone that you can delete, except those that are factory fitted, that's those apps that came with the phone. Mind you, some app that comes with phone can be deleted, can be uninstalled. So go ahead and uninstall all the apps that you can on the phone. But those ones that come with, uh, came with the phone, you can keep them. Okay, if you have the ones that you can disable that are not important, you can disable them. But make sure that you uninstall every app that you can uninstall on the phone, leaving those that came with the phone that you cannot uninstall. So after this, the next thing you are going to do is to uh, get a browser, go with a browser. Let's say if your phone came with Chrome or uh, Safari or uh, Opera Mini, I always uh, recommend Safari and Opera Mini. Okay. So uh, make sure all the device location of these apps are turned off. All right. So uh, once you get a, a browser, I'm going to go to www.facebook.com. Now, mind you, don't add a SIM card in this phone. Use another phone uh, hotspot to connect to the internet. Don't put SIM card on this phone. Be mindful. Don't put any SIM card on this phone. All right. So uh, once this is done, go to www.facebook.com with your browser, not the main app. Mind you, don't install any Facebook app on this phone, be it Meta Business Suite or Facebook app or Facebook Lite or whatever. Go to www.facebook.com and create a new account, brand new account. Okay, create a brand new account. Now, this account, you are not going to create it with a phone number. You are going to create it with an email. So if you don't have an email, go ahead and create a new email. Okay. Remember, don't create it with a phone number. Create it with an email. Right. So once you've created this account, the next thing you're going to do is to send it over to your admin. Let him or her make this account an admin on your page. Once that has been done, Tell the admin to log into this account. Send the details to this account to the admin so that he or she will log in. Now, when he or she logs in, he should make a post with this account on that page in an eligible country. Okay? He or she should make a post. Preferably, he or she should go live. Because when you want to come live, they will ask you uh, on Facebook app, they will ask you of location. They will always get your location. So he or she should come live on this page in an eligible country. So Facebook will automatically detect that they are operating this account in an eligible country. So when he or she posts a video, make a personal, a personal post, like ordinary post, the picture and the rest and goes live, the uh, location of the account will be automatically updated by Facebook to an eligible country. Now, once that is done, come back to www.facebook.com or preferably business.facebook.com. All right. Now log in. When you log in to business.facebook.com with this account, now you can 
post with this account. But when you want to post, go about to business.facebook.com and make your post. Okay. Now remember, the admin should also be logged in in the account. He or she should not log out. Okay. So this method, you can use it uh, and post with an account. You can give the account full access or task asset, whichever assets that you have with this method, you can be able to post on your account and nothing will happen to your monetization. All right. So once that has been gotten, let me go ahead and teach you how to post through Meta Business Suite or business.facebook.com. All right, guys. So when you type business.facebook.com, you are going to log in. That's if you have not logged in before, I am already logged in. So that is why you are seeing this page. Okay, to post, you are going to see create post down here. Remember, my phone is a, in desktop mode. That is why you see that I can move this screen. Okay, I always prefer using desktop mode when posting on Facebook because you can zoom in and you can also zoom out. Okay. So I'm trying to zoom in so that we are going to see this video clearly. Okay. So here you can see create post here. You can see create post. So I'm going to click on create post. That's to post now on this page. When you click create post, it will bring you to this page. Here you will see add photo add video and use templates so click on add video if you click on add video let me zoom a bit you will see upload from desktop then upload upload video and edit facebook only then create video from image now the one you are going to select is upload video and edit facebook only okay uh, there is a reason why you are selecting this. I'm going to explain it later. So you are going to click on media down here. When you click on media, it's going to take you to your gallery. So here you are going to select a video. So I'll go ahead and select any video. All right. So once you select the video, it will start uploading. Okay. It will be imported and it will start uploading. So as you can see here, this is the video. And if you look down here, you see that it's ready. Okay. You see that it's reading 0 0.5, 0 0.6. The speed will be according to the size of the video. Okay. So now let's go over to posting proper. And when you come up, you are going to see title. Here you are going to impute your title. So I'm going to impute uh, how to post. from an eligible country okay so this is the title once that is done come down to description here look at description here so always make sure that you put in your description because this is what people are going to see on Facebook. This is the test that people are going to see on Facebook. So if you want to add tags for those of you that love using tags, uh, tags on their video. Let's see, this video is about Facebook monetization. Monetization, okay? So this is what this video is about. I'm going to type it like this. And Facebook will suggest Facebook monetization. I'll click it. Okay, once you click it, you see that the tag has been added. I hope all of us can see it. I'm trying to zoom this video so that everybody will be able to see it. Remember, I am using the, the desktop version of this browser because I love using desktop version because it allows you zoom in and zoom out as you want. Okay. So once that is done, once that is done, our video is still loading, is still uploading. So you are going to come to the right here. Here you see video details, you see thumbnail. Uh, if you know me very well, I preach thumbnail a lot because thumbnail determines how people will watch your video. It's what attracts people 
to actually start watching your video in the first place. So you click thumbnail. When you click thumbnail, uh, Facebook will ask you that, do you want to choose an auto-generated image from your video? If you want to choose a particular place from your video, just click on choose the thumbnail from video. Okay. But uh, I always design my thumbnail differently. Okay. So I'll just click on add image. When you click on add image, you will go to your media. So when you go to your media, you are going to select one image. So uh, I'll go ahead and select this. So you see the uh, thumbnail will be imported into business.facebook.com. So now once you've done this, what you need to do now is to wait until your video finish uploading. Okay, as you can see here, it's still uploading. Okay, once it shows you that your video has been uploaded, come down here and click on next. As you can see next here, click on next. When you click on next, it will show you publish, schedule post or save draft. If you want to publish this po post now, you click on publish. But if you want to schedule it, like if you want it to upload on Facebook in the next two or three hours or five hours or next tomorrow, next week, click on schedule. When you click on schedule, you, you are going to impute the time that you want this video to upload, the time and the day. And uh, then you click on schedule, all right? So um, if you also want to save this post, maybe you have not finished writing the uh, title, the description, you still need to work on the uh, video later. You can click on save as draft, okay? can click on save as draft. When you click on save as draft, you come here and uh, you click on save as draft. Or if you want to publish the video immediately, click on publish now and you are going to come down here and click publish. All right. So now uh, for those of you that post reels a lot, you'll be asking, okay, this is how to post video on facebook how do we now post reels because you cannot see any reel on this page and uh, the place i show you this is how you post reel or uh, on this uh, right side here you will see this icon this content icon this is called content icon the this one right here so you are going to click on it when you click on it you are going to see content click on content when you click content, let me let me reduce the size of the the screen so that you can see it properly. Okay, so when you click on content, look up here. You see create post and you see create reel. I hope all of us can see it. this is create reel. So you are going to click on your create reel. You are you select the video you want to open. Yeah, it's welcome to my channel. Okay, so right so here. You are going to select the video that you want to upload and you follow the same procedure and add your title and uh, your thumbnail. This is how a uh, reels work. Look at the video that I, I uploaded. Look at uh, the thumbnails, auto-generated thumbnails. So you can select anyone. This is also how it works in the video. Okay. Or you can choose upload image here if you want to use a custom image that you have already edited then you upload it and you still follow the same procedure you click on post here once you have uh, uh, finished everything that you are doing on the page okay so let's say i put on caption let me put in this caption once i put in the caption you let me wait for a it to update okay so as you can see here the video is still loading once it's finished loading in a business.facebook.com you are going to see next button when you see next button you are going to see publish and you go ahead and publish your video so this is a how to operate 
Facebook page from an ineligible country. Till I call your way next time, I remain just to see you again. Stay safe.